This foundation explores children's developing ability to understand words and increasingly complex utterances. At around eight months, children show understanding of a small number of familiar words and react to the infant care teacher's overall tone of voice. Do you want to come play? What do you think? Kalia. Hi. Ah, oh, you're standing. You're standing. You did it. Yay. At around 18 months, children show understanding of one-step requests that have to do with the current situation. Tráeme más. Tráeme más, Ashley. Tráeme ese. Es rojo. Rojo. Pon aquí. Thank you. Es rojo. Oh, oh. Es rojo. Ooh. Here, Alec, put down the table. Put down the table for me. Thank you. Can you shake them loud? Shake them loud. Shake them loud. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shake it loud. You like it loud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shake it loud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shake Shakers, put them in. We're all done. Put them in. Thank you. How are you gonna sit right here, Alyssa? There we go. So Amber, it looks like Alyssa's sitting there. I have another chair over here that you can sit in. There we go. There's a chair for Amber. All right, Charlie. And there's one more thing I need you to get. Can you go get your cup? Where's your cup? Do you remember which one's yours? Oh, there it is. All right. You can come put that in the bin, too. Thank you. ¿Cómo hace la lengua, David? ¿Cómo hace? Samuel, remember the blankie? Can you get the blankie for mommy and cover the baby? Please? Okay, thank you. The baby's cold. At around 36 months, children demonstrate an understanding of the meaning of others' comments, questions, requests, or stories. If you're happy and you know it, roar out loud. Roar! Oh, I want to hear more roars. Anybody else have a roar? Roar! Oh, there you go. If you're happy and you know it, roar out loud. Roar! Do you have a roar, Kaylee? If you want to, you can. What about you, Jake? Do you have a roar? No. No? What about you, Annika? Do you have a roar? You want a roar? If you're happy and ah. you're... There it is. Ah. Now, I have some special toys in here. And I want you to stick your hand in here and give me a ball. Mm-hmm. A ball. a ball. Can you reach in there and give me a spoon? Yeah. Did you drop it? Yeah. Ah. Is that a spoon? It's just. 
That is a block. I got a spoon. You got a spoon. He found a bag. What's in there? You know what's in there? I'm not sure. It's some toys. Turn it to the table. It's some food. It does look like food. It does. You know, Layla? It is food. The toys in here are toys that babies put in their mouths. And then we put them in here because that means we're going to clean them later. So that means those aren't for playing. Do you understand? Sometimes babies put toys in their mouths and then we put it in that basket to clean. Should we do a little tiny story? Yeah. Like once upon a time there was a mouse, he woke up, he ate some cheese, he went back to sleep? No, um, a big one. A big story? Yeah, a big story. Okay, you guys gonna help out? Okay. All right, I need your help with this big story. Okay. All right, here we go. Let's do... Uh, uh, a Hello Kitty. A Hello Kitty story? Yeah, Hello hmm. Kitty. All right, so once upon a time, Hello Kitty woke up and Hello Kitty wanted to take a walk. So Kitty started walking through the forest. And then what happened? Um, a giraffe. Really? And then what did Kitty do? Hi, giraffe. How are you, giraffe? And the giraffe said, I'm fine. And Hello Kitty said, giraffe, do you have any, what would Hello Kitty want? Milk? Pizza? Cat food? What? What was Hello Kitty wanting? What do you think? Water. Water. And okay. Yeah. So water. Hello Kitty said, do you have any water? And the giraffe said? And juice. And juice? And what did the giraffe say, Emma? He said, I do have to use some water. Yeah. And so the giraffe gave Hello Kitty some water and some juice. And then Hello Kitty started walking some more. And Hello Kitty walked to the forest, and then Hello Kitty came to a? Uh, alligator. An alligator? Yeah. Oh. He said hi. 